Hi, I'm Steve Jones and I'm going to tell you what the highest degree of latitude is. Well, first, first of all, what is latitude? And what is longitude? Because that's the other word which is used by navigators. So, latitude are the lines which go around the Earth. And at the top of the Earth, of course, we talk about the North Pole. And these are the lines that go in circles around the North Pole. They are not great circle lines. The only great circle line is zero north, also zero south. That is a great circle. That is, it's the biggest circle you can draw. These circles get smaller. So the lines of latitude get smaller the further north you go. And, of course, also the further south you go. The lines of longitude are always great circles. That is, they always find the largest circle through the North and South Poles. Geographic poles, not magnetic poles. Now, obviously, we start at zero degrees north, and in fact, the North Pole is 90 degrees north. And that is the North Pole. It is not a circle, it is a point. In fact, it's the only point on Earth It has some very strange properties. For example, look, if I walk south five kilometers and then walk around, that is walk uh, east five kilometers and then walk north five kilometers, I end up back where I started. It sounds strange. Walk south, walk east, walk north and I end up back where I am. But that is the peculiar thing about 90 degrees north, which is the highest degree of latitude. Longitude, of course, is different because longitude is related to how far around the Earth we are on great circles. And, of course, zero degrees east or west goes through Greenwich. And Greenwich was where the original uh, lines of longitude were measured from Greenwich in London. So here we have an explanation. The lines of longitude are determined by time. The lines of latitude go from zero and the maximum number is 90.